So let's make a rounded edge tool for 1.76. So first we want to use smooth. So clone your smooth tool. You can call it smooth edge. And then it pops up right here at the bottom. So once you're here in your new smooth tool, you want to go to this little pencil icon. Here you have stroke. So you want to do lock radius. It's going to be on dot, so you want to make sure that it's on lock radius. Then you go to your alpha. These are my settings. Fall off. So for this one, you want to tap on it and go to this, the flat one. So now you have a flat roll off. Filter. These are my settings. I don't change anything. Pressure. I'm going to uncheck use global settings. These are the settings used for all the apps, but we want this to be different. So we uncheck that. Uh, I like to go just back to preset for these. Tap on each one. Flat. Tap on this one. Flat. And that's it. So just once again, we have stroke, lock radius, alpha, fall off is flat, filter and pressure. And both of these are flat. And you want to make sure you turn off use global settings. So the next step, you have your tool here, tap on it, hit save. It's saved. So then you go to the shape that you want to smooth. So let's say this shape, and we're using our smooth edge. So now you want to pull from uh, the middle because it's sort of like a blanket. It sort of blanket smooths it all out. So you want to pull from the middle and I'll do that again. And it starts to smooth everything. You can do it numerous times and it gets smoother and smoother and smoother. So here is the wire mesh. I'll go in real close for my wire mesh friends. So you can see what's happening there, changes the wire mesh. So if you want to make it really smooth, Voxel remesh it low. So Voxel remesh it really low to get a really soft cube like that. If you're doing more hard surface stuff, then you can, re you can remesh it high. So we'll remesh it around 500. There we go, that's better. I'm gonna lock it so I don't click on anything else. Um, and then you use your smooth edge or round edge, whatever you want to call it. You can round it out. And even though it still looks like it's hard edge, we've rounded it out. So you'll be able to decimate it more. Uh, it's 1.49 million. That's way too much. You never want your sculpts to be that high. So then just go here, here, and you can decimate it. Cut it in half. And then it will continue to cut it in half until you find a perfect balance of still looking nice and sharp. 5,000, 2,000. That might be our limit. If we go more, it starts to break a little bit. So if we go back one step, now we have a box that's 731. Looks fairly uh, hard and perfect. And that is essentially the new way to get the round edge. And that is another, that's another way that you can decimate whatever you have, whether it's a character, whatever, you can use this to voxel remesh really high, do the round edge, and then decimate, and it will uh, lower the size of your project, and you'll be able to fit more in the project. Keep drawing, keep sculpting. I'll see you all in the next video. Class dismissed. Thanks so much for watching the video. Be sure to like and subscribe and check out my Skillshare classes for more tutorials. Keep drawing, keep sculpting. I'll see you all in the next video.